through exciting, exhilarating, and unforgettable adventures in the glamorous world of supermodels. Check out some mega hits, see the fashion world up close, and follow our top supermodels, Bettina, Kim, Nikki, and Yasmin. Stranger than fiction. The targets are on that train. I've got just one thing to say to you, ladies. Doc! Say what? Oh. Get him! Get him! Hey! Leave him alone! Oh, I'm sorry. Are you okay? That looked like it really hurt. God! Jake's a stunt! And he's supposed to make it look like yeah. it Yeah, don't worry, Nikki. It's a stunt prop made out of sugar glass, so it shatters oh. easily. You ruined that scene, Nikki, and it was going great. Actually, it's a good job you cut. I didn't think the martial arts Ooh. sequence looked very real. Looked kind of wimpy, so maybe you better do it again, don't you think? Huh? You huh? telling me how to direct? Open mouth and insert foot. Nikki just had the shortest career in film history. Now look, you're... You're right. Hmm. Well, we take the kick on the revoices. Jake will double for Sky this time. Yes, that's a good idea. Why do I have to do my own stunts anyway? I don't get paid to be thrown around the place and get all bruised up. Stunt fellows are paid to take all the risks. I'm paid to be charming and charismatic. Will somebody please gag me before I throw up? We will if you don't keep quiet, Miss Nosy Noodles. Yeah, this is our first big film break, Nikki, and we don't want to blow it. Well, Bettina's done such a knockout job of acting, they'll never let her go. You're a real natural, Bettina. It was a real coup that this mega-budget spy thriller revolves around the fashion industry, right? And we get to shoot it in the Middle East, and there's some really beautiful country out there. We need a crane in here. Come on, guys, move it. 
Remember, Nikki, the rest of us aren't as talented as Bettina. We can be replaced. Oh, thanks, Jake. I'd hate to be replaced. thing about working on a film set is all this free candy. This is one gig I'd really hate to lose. Mmm. Sugo di pomodoro. Sure you would. So no more taunting the director and no hey. more candy. Aww. Give it a rest, Mom. Here. Ah! Mmm. Well, I knew movies were illusions, but I didn't know some movie stars were as well. So come on, guys. How do I tell my brother Julian his hero Terrence Sky's a total weenie? Huh? Look at him, the guy's a pampered pansy. No, no, these t-shirts will never do. My lift curls up too much. Now throw this garbage out and start over with a new picture. <clears throat> yes, Mr. Sky. Anything else, Mr. Sky? Yes, these cups from the burger chain. They need a little more class. Now oh. get it done, girl. <laughs> That's a laugh. He wouldn't know class if it leapt up and bit him. Hey, are you really going to throw out all those t-shirts? But they're perfect. Yes, that's right. These and 5,000 oh. more straight into the trash can, I'm afraid. I don't understand. Why throw them away when they could go to so many needy people? I agree with you, but if you want them, you better ask Sky. I'll be happy to try. Oh, Jake, it's amazing. I still can't believe how dangerous a stunt person's job is. You guys are the real stars of the movie. What's the matter? Hey! Come on now! <laughs> nice to see you too, fella. There you are, Robin. Your own private dressing room. Jake made it for him especially. You know, Robin's really crazy about Jake. Yeah, so is Bettina. They've only been working together two weeks. They're already an item. Oh, well, I'd better be going. I had to change into my tux. I'll see ya. I see ya. refused to be banned from the set. Oh, the nerve of that man. Who does he think he is? I'm the director Ooh. of this film, lady, and I'm ordering you to get off the set. I never. <laughs> but Tina shows tremendous talent when I'm the one giving her direction. We'll see about this just as soon as Madame Nadia returns my call. <laughs> I feel bad for my mother, but I know that with her out of the way, Jake and I will really have a chance to get to know each other. He's so <laughs> special. <laughs> and so romantic, too. Sure, so, so romantic. romantic. Hey, let's go and see Prince Charming in his next scene, huh? I hear it's going to be pretty exciting. Oh, I can't look. Frazzled Petalcini, my nerves are more frayed than a really bad perm. Oh. <laughs> Man, that looks like a lot of fun. Okay, Mother? Oh, dear. Oh, my. I came out and saw poor Yasmin in trouble, and I just... What the dickens? Countess, allow me to introduce my stunt double, Angie. You're incredible, Angie. Well, thanks. The idea is to make you look good, Yasmin. That's my job. Okay, loves. I'm ready for my close-up. Brilliant stunts, weren't they? Oh, brilliant. <sighs> oh, Mr. Scott! Sure thing, kid. Oh. 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 That stunt wasn't bad, Jake, but my fans expect a lot more of me, so I think you ought to go the extra mile. Try and wait a little longer before you bail out next time if you can, okay? I know you can do it. Stuntmen are ten a penny, but there's only one Terrence Sky. Bossy Bocconcini, if he waits any longer, Jake is going to be a fried stuntman. I don't understand how you can do a job like this, Jake. It must take an awful lot of courage, hmm? Oh, don't you worry, Bettina. All these stunts are perfectly coordinated. We spend days, sometimes weeks, preparing for every possible contingency. But, Jake, what if something goes wrong? What if they hit you and they shoot at you, for instance? No, they don't really shoot at me. Come over here and I'll show you how it's done. Come on. First of all, the guns we use fire blank rounds, making the muzzle of the gun look like a bullet has been fired. It's dangerous, but we're carefully trained. Where is it? Uh-huh. <laughs> to create the illusion of an incoming bomb, charges are planted at specific points in the sand and triggered by a remote. What's this computer for? 
We use computers to coordinate the effects. We often simulate a scene on computer first. It helps reduce the risk of anyone getting hurt. What's Karen doing? Oh, well, Karen here is rigging this plane for bullets. What do you mean, Jake? Yeah, how does it work? We attach a series of mini explosives like tiny fireworks along the side of the plane spaced apart. They're placed roughly where a spray of bullets might hit. With the charges and the wires placed, I carefully paint over them, and with precision timing, the charges are triggered by remote control. When the gun with the blanks is fired at the plane, it creates the illusion of shots hitting the aircraft. Hours of work for a few seconds on film. This kind of thing can take ah. days to set up. Is this the kind of remote control you use? Run for it! Shampoo, that's not the kind of remote we use. That is the remote we use. Hours of work ruined. I'm gonna have to get more supplies oh, and start sorry. over. I'm sorry, Karen. It was entirely my fault. Bummed out, her Shampoo. It'll take uh -huh. hours to get your hair back into shape. Huh? Hey, look. There's no driver. Be careful, Jake. Look out. Look out. Hey, oh, oh, oh. I've got a better idea. You save me. You okay, Jake? Ah, such heroism. And perfect timing. Jake, oh. I'm perfectly all right, thank you. Good thing I saw that vehicle coming. You girls are lucky you were with me. Now then, I think oh, we are. Oh, Jake, that! You're an absolute oh, man. You really upset you. Come on, Jake. Hey, so many girls, don't you want an autograph? Girls, girls, somebody pick me up. <laughs> oh, okay. So tell me, how could an accident like that happen? That was no accident. Somebody started that engine on purpose. Huh? This isn't the first accident we've had. Before you girls arrived here, there were plenty of others. There must be a jinx on this film or something. I don't believe in jinxes, but it sounds like someone's trying to sabotage this film. We did receive some threats, but until now we thought they were just harmless pranks. But I guess we're gonna have to rethink. Hmm. You don't think the vamps could possibly be behind all this, do you? What, halfway across the world? Brandon Vamp is powerful. Don't underestimate him. And Anna Vamp's jealousy would stretch further than a Mount Everest of spaghettini. Hmm. It's hard to think about food after what happened today. Well, almost. But I guess I can force myself as they've gone to so much trouble putting out such a great buffet. Bulging bruschetta, naughty Nikki will end up rolling out of here, not walking. It's kind of weird having this hotel all to ourselves. It feels real creepy. It's so strange. I mean, we're all staying on the ground floor while the rest of the hotel is completely empty. Well, it happens sometimes, Bettina. We find a hotel about to do renovations and then we just take it over. We'll be shooting explosive scenes on the upper floors, doing a lot of damage. And since they're going to be remodeling, we don't have to waste time and money building sets. Films are run to a very tight budget these days. I mean, why waste money, right? Which, of course, is natural for a star. Speaking like of not wasting resources, could I speak to you, Mr. Sky? It's about those t-shirts you ordered to be thrown out. I'd like to donate them to a children's organization, in your name, of course. Oh, no, I'm not having my imperfect image emblazoned across the chests of a bunch of losers. Yes, but... Forget it, Yasmin. He's a selfish egomaniac. Nothing will change him. You're just wasting yeah, your time. Yeah, but it was worth a try. What an exhausting day. Come, Bettina. You go ahead, Mother. I'll be up in a couple of minutes, OK? All right, dear, but don't dally. Hmm. I suppose tomorrow I'll be banned from sitting down to dinner as well. Depends how you behave, Countess. Depends how you behave. Ladies, I'm afraid I can't stay late either. I have to reload charges to replace the ones we blew in the plane today. So, good night. Oh, well, I guess we're all pretty tired after today's excitement. Nobody knows. Ah, terrifying Terrazza. Tell me this is part of the movie. No, I'm afraid this is the real thing. Ah, oh, save me. So, this is the famous Terrence Sky. Pathetic. Don't worry now. Jake! 
What is it? What do you want? We want you! No, leave me alone! I'm not a hero! I'll give you money, anything! Look, I'm pathetic! Leave me alone! Forget it! We need a world-famous hostage to make sure that our leader is released from prison, so we're taking you with us now. Let's go! Well, why don't you take the supermodels instead of me? There's four of them! What huh? a weenie! Wait a minute, having four supermodels would give us more bargaining power. Okay, we take the hero and the girls, but we'll have to dispose of the other men. Howly and Chowbies! Does he mean us? No! Get them! Right! Now, where did a nice girl like you learn to do that? It's something Jake taught me. Ah, get her! Catch! Uh, oh. Oh. Head for the door. I'll hold them off as long as I can. Oh. Come on, Jake, hurry! Let's go! What are you doing? Oh. Oh. Wait, don't leave me! All right, get out the bed! So what else have you got in that bag of tricks, Jake? Some effects magic. Go to the end of the corridor and turn right. What about you? I'll be right behind you. Okay. There they are! Get them! Come on! Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Crumbling colazioni! All this running cannot be good for the digestion! All right, everyone. We'll make our stand right here. Don't worry, everybody. This is one of our sets, and it's already rigged for special effects. But we gotta buy some more time somehow. Here, somebody help me to move this freezer over. Right, sure. We're right with you, Jake. I'm sorry, but I might break a finger now. <sighs> I must say, that was quite impressive, ladies. Oh, come on. We work out. Hey, we're top models. Supermodels rule! I'm gonna need your help to fight off these terrorists, so everybody lend a hand. Robin, what is it, boy? What's the matter? Hey! Oh, Robin, come back at once! He'll eat you alive, Robin! But it hasn't eaten him alive. Why is that? Relax, Robin, it's animatronic. It's just a prop for the film. Operated by remote control. It's okay, sweetums. Come to me. The dog is not real. Break the door oh. down! Okay, yeah! Break the door down! Huh? We're gonna have to hurry, or they'll soon be inside. Uh, you have to save me, please. Uh. Boy, you're some hero. Now that's not. what I call a photo shoot. Classic photo opportunity, if ever there was one. Here, ladies, take these communications devices. Now, there are motion detectors planted all through the kitchen, but we're gonna need some help to work this. To monitor you guys on the computer and tell us when the terrorists are in range. Sounds right up my street. Nikki and Yasmin, you guys will work as one team, okay? And Bettina and I will work together as the other. Is that all clear? All clear, but what shall I do, Jake? You can babysit the hero. You have to keep him from blowing it. Gag him if you have to. Now that's a job I can really get my teeth into. Okay, girls, now here's the plan. We're almost in. Just keep batting. Hey, over here, up, fellas! Boys. Get after them. I'll take care of the others. Let's go. Move it! Two coming at you from behind. Nikki, okay? Now, Nikki! That's two down, Kim. Where are they now, Kim? Talk to me. Two coming due east with you in eight seconds. Get up! Now, Nikki. Away. We make a great team, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> What? <gasps> oh, good boy, come on. Come on, I'll shoot. I mean it. Come on. Hey, what the? Get back. No. 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 Yeah. Hey, 
Gotcha. Too bad the dog lost his head like that. What's the matter? Scared of a little toy doggy? Oh, Jake, I'm so proud of you. I'm proud of you too, Bettina. Well, we did it. You guys okay? Is nice job, hurt? everybody. That was absolutely fantastic. Did you get any of it on film? All we got was one amazing photograph of posterity. Uh, now, look here. Uh... Tell us, Sky, how did you manage to overcome the terrorists? It was nothing really, Nina. I just saved the day, as usual. Uh, uh... Huh? Well, I... I know, but it's better for the film to let the star take all the glory. Besides, we all know the truth, don't we? So, here we are at the premiere of the Supermodels feature film debut. I can't you believe it. The director actually banned me from the set. I mean, really. Banned you from the set? That's absolutely unbelievable. I wonder why he'd do anything like that, Countess. <laughs> hey, hey. Wow, unbelievable. You got a genuine autograph picture of Terrence Sky. Wow. That's huh? right, a genuine autographed picture of Terrence Sky. But since my sister told me what a wimpy is, well, who needs it? Uh, People need heroes. Real heroes like the supermodels. Seems to be a success. Looks like your first film is gonna be a blockbuster, Bettina. Yes, but now that it's over, we have to say goodbye, don't we? This isn't goodbye, Bettina. It's just so long for a while. You have to go back to modeling, and I'm starting a new film. Oh, Robin. <laughs> 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 That's funny. Everybody's gone. I wonder where the others have disappeared to. They were here just a moment ago. Free t-shirts! Get your free t-shirts! Here. Oh, that's so kind of you. I just can't believe that Terrence Sky, the cheapest creep in the business, agreed to donate all these t-shirts for nothing. It's absolutely incredible. Oh, yeah, but that's nothing. Well, see? From now on, Sky has agreed to give half of his film income to charity. He makes 15 million per film, so he won't starve. I'd say that was extremely generous of him, wouldn't you? Yeah, just imagine a little photograph helped all of those people. Remember, Supermodel's Super Rule! It's amazing how many old clothes we have just lying around. Yeah, and none of it is stuff that we wear anymore. It just sits in the closet collecting dust and dirt. I'm glad Yasmin suggested we donate the things we don't wear anymore to charity. It's really easy to do. There are lots of organizations set up to help the needy. All you have to do is check out the phone directory, and you'll find them. Couldn't be easier. Or surf the net. Some charities will even come and pick up your donations so you don't have to deliver them, so it really isn't that difficult. And it feels really great to help others. For sure. And there's always something that you can do to help others. Supermodels roll! Pilfering pepperonis! When the supermodels travel to a foggy English town for a charity fashion shoot at a spectacular country castle, a feisty street girl steals Nikki's purse. But instead of turning her over to the police, Nikki and the girls try to turn her into a fashion model. Will the girls succeed in changing Maria's life for the better? Or is it once a thief, always a thief? Well, don't miss this high fashion fairy tale full of romance and suspense. The next episode of Supermodels.